Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Microsoft has made a brand new Canary Channel flight available. Yesterday on the 9th of October, inside a preview build 27723. So if you are in the Canary Channel or you're just interested in what Microsoft is working on uh, in the Insider program, then just a quick overview. So first of all, um, the first feature actually has made its way to the stable version of Windows 11 already where if you go do a search for a, a local file on your computer, um, you can now share that file. So that previously wasn't available. So Microsoft say they are beginning to roll out the ability to share local files directly from within the search results shown in the search box on the taskbar. And as mentioned, that's already made its way into the stable version. So Canary playing a little bit of catch up with that one. And then voice access which is an accessibility feature what they've done here is you can now use the um, entire voice access session where the spelling experience now will now enable you to dictate the characters at a faster speed and offer more editing flexibility inside uh, the experience according to microsoft with dictation commands namely selection deletion and text navigation commands and i'm always in favor of um, accessibility improvements being made in the Windows OS or any OS for that matter or browser and this one's kind of rolling out across the board in the Insider program where there's a new simplified Chinese font with 9753 audio graphs supporting Unicode extensions GH and I and apparently they've also included the highly requested character U plus 30 EDD, which is said to be the most complicated Chinese character. So that's an interesting development um, in the Canary channel, but that's also rolled out to dev and beta. And then when it comes to settings, Microsoft says the detach virtual hard disk VHD or VHDX button that it added under settings uh, introduced in a previous build has temporarily been disabled starting with build 27718 and Microsoft says that it's working to re-enable this change in a future flight soon. So obviously there's been a couple of issues with that feature which is common in this kind of early preview version of Windows 11. And because we are in a very early preview version of Windows 11, we can also expect to see a couple of known issues. There are one, two, three, four in total. And guys, that's more or less what's happening in the Canary channel for this week with build 27723. Not much really going on, but just to keep you posted in case you would be interested. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.